it's really a question of always thinking about what will be a little bit different about this next book project of mine that will make you happy, that will give you thrills, but at the end of the day make you smile when you finish one of my books. Um, one of the things I do with XO, which is uh, a little bit different, because it involves a country western singer, I wrote an album of country western songs. Um, years ago I was a singer-songwriter. I was probably a better songwriter than I was a singer, but I enjoyed performing very much and enjoyed crafting songs. And uh, that was many years ago. But I, I decided in writing a book about a country western star, what a perfect opportunity to write an album of songs which contain clues as to whether this nefarious stalker, Edwin Sharp, is going to fulfill his mission or not to get close to my heroine. The, uh, the songs I, I wrote over a period of about six months, there are 11 of them, and not content just to put the lyrics in the book itself, I hired musicians in Nashville and recorded an album, which will be available at all retail locations where CDs are sold and available from uh, various uh, platforms, download and streaming platforms. Now the centerpiece song is called Your Shadow, and this was inspired by the, uh, the, the hit from the police many years ago called Every Breath You Take, which could be a love song, but could also be something very, very different, something much more ominous. Uh, Your Shadow has four verses in it, and in my book, XO, the villain, Edwin Sharp, the uh, stalker, uses each verse as a model for a crime that is about to occur. And Catherine Dance, my heroine, has to figure out how he's going to use that verse and try to uh, stop him. We recorded the album in Nashville. It's now available for downloads. You can go to uh, my website, jeffreydeaver.com, and find out where and when uh, you can get these uh, songs if you're interested in them. And uh, I, I, I think it's been a, a very fun project to combine that uh, uh, joy of writing songs I had many years ago with the joy of writing novels now.